एवरीवन वेलकम टू फोर्स हेड्स टीवी विद मी अंजलि द रीसेंट स्प्लिट बिटवीन द एआईटीएमके एंड बीजेपी हैज रेज्ड कंसर्न्स अबाउट द बीजेपी प्रोस्पेक्ट्स इन साउथर्न इंडिया विद द एआईटीएमके विद ड्राइंग इट्स सपोर्ट द बीजेपी चांसेस ऑफ विनिंग इन तमिलनाडु सीम अनसर्टेन सिंस द पासिंग ऑफ जयललिता इन 2016 द एआईटीएमके हैड बीन अ वैलेबल अलाई फॉर द बीजेपी हाउएवर द डिसीजन टू सेवर टाइज विद द एनडीए ऑन बोथ नेशनल एंड स्टेट लेवल्स माइट प्रूव डिसएडवांटेजेस for the bjp the permanence of this split remains to be seen but its potential consequences would hinder the bjp's efforts to establish a strong hold in southern india here's a special report from four sides tv The upcoming 2024 elections could be influenced by the future political landscape potentially leading to a shift in power among Tamil Nadu parties and their alliances. This shift may result in the AIADMK losing the support of the Modi government which has been a strong ally. Experts predict that the separation between the BJP and AIADMK will likely be temporary. Leaders from both parties have advised their members to refrain from making negative remarks about each other. The BJP is seeking to gain more support in the southern region and hopes to secure additional seats through partnerships. Former AIA DMK minister Munu Swami recently announced that his party is cutting ties with the BJP and NDA. He accused the BJP state chief Annamalai of intentionally damaging the reputation of respected party members including former chief minister CN Annadurai and Jayalalitha. This decision could have significant implications for state and national politics. AIA DMK is the only major partner of the BJP at the national level. Previously the NDA included larger parties like Shiv Sena, Akali Dal, Telugu Desam and AIA DMK. However, now AIA DMK remains the only party in the alliance. This loss is particularly significant for the BJP as it has been unable to establish a sustainable presence in Tamil Nadu where power has alternated between the DMK and AIA DMK since 1967. Out of their 50 years, AIA DMK has ruled for 30. Tamil Nadu has two main political parties, AIA DMK and DMK. AIA DMK is a popular party with a large membership of 2 crore people providing an alternative to the DMK both the DMK and AI DMK the two main dravidian parties have supported the BJP at different times for years the BJP has faced challenges in winning over voters in Tamil Nadu The Dravidian movement initiated by E.V. Ramaswamy Nicker has deeply embedded itself in the form of the DMK and AI DMK parties. In the last Lok Sabha elections, the BJP only secured 3% of the vote, while the two Dravidian parties had a solid 25% base. Since 2016, the AI DMK party has suffered continuous defeats in all elections. It lacks charismatic leaders like Jayalalitha or founder M.G. Ramachandran, both of whom were matinee idols. In the most recent assembly polls in 2021, the party's performance declined, winning only 75 seats compared to the previous 136. The DMK Congress coalition assumed power in the 2019 Lok Sabha polls AIA DMK secured just one seat a significant decrease from their previous 37 seats meanwhile the DMK coalition seats increased from 0 to 39 consequently AIA DMK parties viewed their alliance with the BJP as a hindrance the BJP's attempt to win over voters in Tamil Nadu failed due to conflicting ideologies The Dravidian parties are non-believers while the BJP's primary election strategy revolves around the Ram Temple in Ayodhya and Sanatan Dharma. The upcoming Lok Sabha elections are crucial for the BJP while the AIA DMK is focusing on the 2026 assembly polls. The outcome will heavily depend on the coalitions formed by the two Dravidian parties. Prime Minister Modi is determined to secure a third term in the 2024 elections. Insiders suggest that anomalous behavior was not the primary reason for the split. Despite numerous complaints, the AIA DMK is dissatisfied that the BJP has not taken action against Annamalai. There is a significant disagreement over seat sharing between the two parties. Both failed to win seats in Tamil Nadu in the 2019 elections due to a lack of shared ideology. Annamalai has proposed 
planning independently in the election and some BJP members are considering this idea. Annamalai aims to form a coalition with smaller parties. AIADMK chief Edappadi Palaniswamy has successfully united the party and worked with senior leaders to prevent the re-entry of Sasikara, TTV Dinakaran and former chief minister O Pannir Selvam. Even if the BJP offers them seats under its quota, Palani Swami is determined to keep them out of the AIA DMK and maintain full control. He fears that their entry would diminish his authority. The ruling DMK coalition is concerned about potential effects on their party and some suggest that Congress may ally with the AI DMK. The final outcome will depend on the number of seats each alliance is able to win. Lok Sabha elections hold immense significance for major political parties such as the DMK, AIDMK, Congress and BJP. Among them, the BJP stands to gain or lose the most based on several crucial factors. Caste affiliations, financial resources and political influence are expected to greatly influence the outcome of these elections. The BJP's performance in the five states' assembly polls will play a critical role in determining their success or failure. While the party currently holds an advantageous position, it is important to remember that in politics, circumstances can shiftly change. With six months remaining until the Lok Sabha elections, anything can happen. As the BJP eagerly strives to strengthen its foothold, it must navigate the intricate dynamics of caste, mobilize its financial resources effectively, and leverage its political influence to secure a favorable outcome. The BJP's ability to address these factors and adapt to unforeseen events will ultimately determine their fate in the Lok Sabha elections. In essence, the upcoming Lok Sabha elections are a defining moment for the DMK, AIDMK, Congress and BJP. However, it is BJP that has the most to gain or lose. With the interplay of caste, financial resources and political influence, the BJP's performance in the five states assembly polls will be crucial. While the BJP currently holds an advantage, the ever-changing nature of politics leaves room for uncertainty. As the next six months unfold, the BJP must remain vigilant, adaptable and focused to secure a favorable outcome in the Lok Sabha elections. Thank you for watching Foresight's TV with me, Anjali.